Hey, this is Kerry. Um, I haven't done a video in a while, but uh, it's 2017 and there's a hurricane coming in the Gulf. Should have some surf. And as you can see, got some surfboards back there. But the bad news is this is my brother's <laughs> Robert August board. And it fell and put a big old ding right there, there, and there. So I've cut this piece. I'm going to try to, after I fill it, I'm going to try to put it back there. It's hard to do. All right, so that's a big old hole. See the the depth of that hole. Right, so uh, <laughs> I'm going to use this stuff to fill it, then shave it down. I got my fiberglass and everything to repair it all. So let's see how that works. Okay. So I just added spray some of the great stuff in there and it's gonna rise up and just as a heads up have some alcohol ready to wipe that shit off because it went everywhere. Uh, just as a heads up, be aware. Alright, 10 4. We'll shave that off in a little while. This is going to work out. Heavy ding repair. Big old deep stuff. Here we go. Okay. Back to the ding repair you can see that uh, foam great stuff worked pretty good that's actually a second application trying to close the cells because it blows up the outside is real smooth but you get down in it and it's uh, pretty porous so that's a second amount I pulled the tape off and using a razor blade to just kind of clean up the edges so that my fiberglass will stick. I'm probably going to let that harden a little bit more. I got a lamp on it to uh, maybe dry it up a little harder. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, as long as it doesn't react to my fiberglass, it should be okay. Uh, then I'll retape it along these same lines. Just want to get whatever residue off so that my fiberglass will stick to fiberglass. So I'm going to probably sand that a little bit. Cut into that, drop it down. But that's cool. All right, I'm about to do my Bondo and fiberglass. I got my pieces cut, uh, everything filled, everything ready. The directions say, for small amount, 10 tablespoons to a quarter teaspoon. So I put 20 and a half, for, just for good measure, of the half tablespoons about to do the quarter teaspoon of the hardener put it in there put those in it get after it and we'll see if this works I put some uh, baking soda fill in the holes I read that would work sometimes so let's see well that's what we got 
I've got to dry and be sanded and hopefully leave out at 0500 a.m. in the morning and catch some waves. I'm not sure what that white shadow is. It's all right. It all looks good. Doable. Surfable, for sure. Hope my little brother likes it. <laughs> Dried enough to start sanding it. Quite a bit of sanding left to go, but I'm tired. It's uh, late and I'm getting up early, so I'm gonna surf it with that. And Robert August. Nine six. Martinson, the model. I'll, that'll look better when I finish it, but I'm going surfing in the morning. Shipping is free and you have a hundred nights to try it out. Go to helixsleep.com slash talk radio and get $50 off. Well, it's Saturday after my surfing Hurricane Harvey day on Friday morning. So I got back trying to finish out this ding repair I've got it sanded down to really where I want to leave it just a little edge mainly because I don't want to I want this thing to stick so we got a little bit of edge but I'm going to paint over that so we'll see how that comes out I got a paint that'll look close hit it just lightly all right Well, that's my ding repair. Found the paint that was close. That'll work. Sorry, little brother. But you're back up and running. I surfed it yesterday. Hurricane Harvey. Just finished it off today. <laughs> 